Hi guys, welcome to this session. In today's session, we're going to talk about Microsoft Advertising Experiments. Experiments is a feature, guys, which you will get inside Microsoft Ads, with the help of which we can make a copy of the original campaigns running. And then in that, we can make different changes and then we can run it along with the original campaign. So it's like a A-B testing of the campaign which you are doing, wherein you are trying out different types of landing pages, keywords, ads, and you're trying to see what other experiments which you can do, which might work for the business. So this is a great feature with the help of which we can make changes, we can tweak the changes and make changes to the campaign without disturbing the original setup. And you can now experiment with different types of combinations. So let's have a look at this guys, how we can go ahead and apply this inside the account. So once we are inside the Microsoft Ads account, we can come to experiments on the left panel and here with this plus create button we can start creating an experiment we can first select the campaign whose experiment which we want to create so we want to create a copy of that so now here you can start creating the experiment by giving all the details you can give the start date end date and also you can give the experiment split experiment split is the percentage of the original campaigns budget and the traffic we will use in this experiment campaign. So you can allocate out here and then you can save it. Once you save this, this becomes like a experiment campaign now of the original campaign. And it's going to be a replica of the original one which you get. So now in this, you can start making various changes. For example, let's say we want to make some changes to the ads. So we can go to the specific ads and we can start making changes first. So let's go to the ads and extensions on the left panel. And here we can modify the ads in this specific manner. So you can modify the ad and make it better. We can also make changes to the keywords So here you can add more different keywords if you want to. We can also modify the extensions and audiences if we want. So let's look at some audiences. So like this you can make multiple changes in the experiment campaign. So let's say we are adding some different types of audiences now in this. Then you can also make modifications to the demographics. So here you can make some changes to the demographics as well. You can add some different extensions and then compare them also. So like then let's say we are going to create a call out extension specifically. So you can try out new callouts and see if that works for the business. So like this, you can make multiple changes in the experiment campaign and now you can let it run. So what will happen is once you, once the campaign comes to an end, at that time you can, you have two choices. Either you can apply all those changes to the original campaign from which you had made a copy of it or you can run this as a new campaign in the account. So in this manner guys, we can make use of the experiment feature inside the Microsoft Ads account. I hope this makes sense and you understand the concept of experiments in Microsoft Ads. Thank you so much guys for listening into this session today. Have a great day guys.